Hey guys, welcome to Camo's Place. We're going to be playing more of God of War Ragnarok. We ended the last episode, so hopefully I should be right near that Berserker uh, gravestone. If I'm not, you'll probably see me start from that Berserker gravestone anyway, and we'll jump straight into a battle. So, you know how I usually do this, if I, you know, I'll play the first one, and then you'll see the last one if I don't beat him the first time. But look, the last few I did... Um, I got second goes, um, which which is pretty good. One of them I got first go, which was a, an entire fluke. But anyway, let's continue on. I'm really having fun with this game. Hopefully you're having fun watching through. And if you can, leave any likes um, and any comments below. I really appreciate it. If this is the first time you've been on my channel, welcome. If you've been here before, welcome back. Guys, let's jump into it. God of War, Ragnarok. Alright. Oh! We loaded up here. Hey! <laughs> okay, well, let's continue on. Actually, got this by accident. Well, I loaded in here, um, and I wasn't going to show this bit um, because number one, I didn't think I was going to get it. Okay, let's see what angle you need. Yeah, that one. That's not going to work. Let's go here. Whoa, what okay, came over this way? Sweet. Alright, so we ended up getting this chest. How <laughs> cool is that? Um so yeah, if I was a bit quiet at the start, that's why. Um, I did add to end the last episode abruptly. Let's go back to the map. Oh, we've, we've opened 40 or 50 legendary chests. Um, it was because I needed to go to the toilet, so I had to quickly go. Okay, so we've got a remnants now. Let's, we're doing Berserker first. Or should we do the remnants, actually? Okay, sorry to be flippy floppy. Flippity floppity. Let's do the remnants first. Because the berserker battle is going to be huge. So how's everyone's day going today? Yeah, back to the story of your brother. You said the elves saw him emerge from the Lake of Souls. It's true. I don't know whether he worked his charms at that point or they just assumed him to be a great deal. But of course, he hadn't made this journey in search of responsibility, so he didn't stick around long. Still, the legend of his manifestation was passed along through the ages. It even endured after the Great Division, remembered by light and dark elf alike. So when at last he returned, he was uniquely situated to gain the trust of both sides and help to create the truce. But the problem was, both sides trusted only him. So the peace could only last as long as he stayed around to keep it. And with the long war dragging on without an end in sight, I suppose making any kind of peace was an irresistible notion for him. Even if it meant having to go. Uh, I think it's just around this way. I could see the lights in the distance. I just didn't want to talk while Freya was talking. So the Berserker fight's just there. That. 44 hex silver, I won't say no to that. Alright, how do we get up there? Let's 
Is there a secret? No, nothing there. Is there a weird way up? What the hell was that? Thanks for the hex silver. I know I'm going away from it, but. That's an entrance to go down, but. We're looking like we need to go up. Okay, so let's run around here. Maybe we need to do the Berserker first. Oh, here we go. Nope, we can do here first. Resurrection stone, I don't want to waste it. Nah, just, just take me out. Take me out. Are you serious? Okay, so. Let's take these guys on. Halfway through this. Oh. Nice. Nice. Move. Move. 
Nice. Nice, we got him. Seems for every camp we destroy, we find two more. It's almost impressive. <laughs> Stinner and Sturker, brothers still in the service of Odin after Asgard has fallen. What? They had hoped to achieve in the deserts of Alfheim has now blown away with the sands of the wind. Should any more Asgardian forces remain loyal to Odin, I will rid this land of them. That's a cool um, start. Armor. We've got all this cool new stuff, which I, I'm keeping. I'm keeping with um, Lunda's armor. What's this one? Increases the damage of a runic attack. There was a real cool one. Combo finishes provide extra charge of the permafrost. Regenerating essence, perk requirement, vitality 50. Okay, so I can't do that. I've got a requirement. Very high luck chance to grant a health burst on any successful runic attack kill. Stunning fan, hitting stunned enemies, unleashes shockwaves. Um, runic attacks of three different weapons and quicks. We actually do that a fair bit. Um, axe and blade, melee attacks, hexed. Remedy Bifrost successful. Get attacks against enemies will cleanse small amounts of Bifrost. Dodge rolling will hasten the experience of. Okay. Increases resilience, blind, and daze by 50%. That's pretty cool. 25%. that one increases melee damage during realm shifts increases damage of all creates death from above attacks don't need that boon of wrath boon of fury uh, now nah, I'm gonna keep what I've got weapons What's this? Successful process throws increased barehanded damage for a duration. Um, moderate luck chance. Yeah, these significantly drop me. Yeah. No, I'm happy with what we got. I haven't really had to change. Fuck, look at that axe up. I haven't really had to change much of our loadouts. Alright, this berserker fight. Let's do it. A vengeful berserker gravestone. Oh, what's that mean? Can we read this? Maybe it'll give us a clue on how to beat it. Alright, Golan Cull. Thanks to the opposition's grotesque hypocrisy, Alphine's Gulon are a threat to our livelihood. Though I've culled many of the surface, there are undoubtedly more down below the Dark Elves' hovels. So long as we deny them access to our light, the pair at the desert's entrance shall remain the only docile version of these foul beasts. Let them remain. They will serve as useful subjects for further light infusion experimentation. The Maven. Okay. Ready, guys? We're gonna jump into it. Get taken off. Come under the cloak. Dagger the cloak. Better about the blade. Holy shit! Is that three people here? Oh shit! Move. Oh shit! Jeez. Oh, man. 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 Wait. Hey. 
You're not very nice. Oh, jeez. Kick my ass. Oh, shh. Oh. Okay, that was my first attempt. Oh, got a resurrection stone. Maybe I should take out the other one first. Oh. Are you serious? Okay. Alright, so we've got three Berserkers at once, and these guys know how to fight. Well, they um, have interesting attack moves. Try move. Oh, piss off, man. Oh, get away from me. Oh, you, you stop me through my combo, man. Actually, oh, get away. Ah, oh, get away! Alright, let's try and get you. Move! Oh. Fuck, I didn't get to use my rage. Okay. Use the rest of the rage on this dude. Take this out. Nice. Okay, wait. Oh, if you push A once, you get a better dodge. Shield movement and it wouldn't make me bloody. 
Time. Please, please, baby, yes. Oh, I wonder if that counts for three berserkers. Berserkers, what then? We pay the king a visit and give him more of the same. We have seen this before. Revenge will not bring you peace. Is it revenge if justice is served? That is a question you must answer for yourself. Yeah, that, that was the hardest one. That was definitely the hardest one. Alright, let's look at the map. I think we've pretty much cleared. Oh, we've got to do this, the last remnants, and we've got a question mark. Let's put that on the compass. Alright, let's do it. Yeah, that that was the that was the hardest one we've done so far, by far. Alright, let's grab that. I really do want to focus on these berserk fights. <laughs> Number one, they're pretty fun. Even though they're hard, they're a good challenge though. They're a, they're a fun challenge, if that makes any sense. Like those three, I probably had about 10 goes against them. I'm probably underestimating myself there, but... Um, yeah. But my strategy in the end was to go for the weaker ones, which was the sisters. But it was hard because the big guy... After, obviously, after war. Wait a bloody moment. Is that Thor's hammer and oh. his daughter? Oh. I'll make you proud, Dad. I thought I had to walk from this bit. <laughs> oh. Well, good for her. Alright, let's upgrade the axe, definitely. Oh, real good for wood. Better for bones. That got on nine. We're on level eight at the moment. Can I upgrade the blades of chaos? Not enough resources for that. Sword. My lady. No, I'm happy with the sword. I'm liking this one. Defense and luck. These ones are craftable but upgradable. Sh um, chance to trigger a realm shift, slowing down when parrying. Checking, did I? Yeah, that's good. So we've got that upgraded all the way. Yeah, nice, nice. Now luck's pretty high, so I'm, I'm lucky our life, our, our luck. Spear. Spears at nine. That's at nine. Moderate luck chance granting health burst on any successful spear kill. We don't really kill with the spear though. I've got so much yet. Yeah. Oh. If I look like that, I'd stand around and just let folks there do. I'll sell all artifacts. All this for a little old me? Nice. Let's 
got a bit of feels half crazy to say it, but I've got a good feeling about that shrewd girl. <laughs> Never mind in what family she came from. I quite agree. She's an impressive young woman. I thought you might. Well, I ain't never seen anyone quite so awestruck as when she laid eyes on you back at the hall. Like, meeting her idol. She was apparently quite eager to learn from all the Valkyries. Now that she has Mjolnir, I expect her next stop will be to begin training with Sigrun. I think Brock and Sindri would be happy knowing that hammer's finally with someone worthy to wield it. And a future Valkyrie, no less. So I'm probably going to cut this, but what I'm going to do is, I'm going to... Everything I can craft, I'm just going to start crafting. Alright, I'm back. I just upgraded everything, but I haven't changed my loadout. We'll check that out soon. Anyway, let's keep going. Oof, that took ages. Okay, looks like they stay here and we go down. Yeah, it, I think it was sucky that you had to do it one at a time for each stage, each part, and each, yeah, it was, it's actually really weird. Alright, looks like there's some wind up here. Either wind or some, yeah, probably wind. Could have teleported. Oh, we got a realm tear. There's another of Garm's realm tears nearby. <laughs> I forgot what comes out of a realm tear. Follow me. Bit of aid. Hello, follow me. Oh shit, where are we going? Now we've still got some ravens. Okay. We are going the right way. To now. What is this stuff around here? Ok, 
Okay, is there something I can climb or... What the hell is this? Okay. A little bit lost. I can hear something. Let's map it up. Okay, so this, okay, so I came down for no reason at all. I guess it's easier to climb up than down, right? Imagine looking down. No, there's nothing. Nothing there. Go this way. This is where we came from. Okay, so I'm running towards where it is, but it's kind of yeah. That that was weird. The numbers were going up, but I was running away. I don't remember this area at all. Oh, sorry, Freya, I didn't mean to stab you in the back. Alright. Let's go this way. Alright, that's one of the remnants over there. Let's go look at how to get up now. Because that's where we got to go, right? But it's up another level. Do we need to go around and up? There we go. Freya, you go first. Has to be this way, right? Don't mind if I get this. Yeah, we're not at full strength, but that's okay. We're going to give it a good shot anyway. This one definitely was a lot harder than that. Truly thankless work. It must be done. I'm sure the civilians were for taking would thank us. Well, thank both of you. Me, they would just point out and scream. Eight of ten. Shit, we've already done eight of them. Okay, let's look at the map. We're done. Oh. Forbidden the desert door. Click the key from the desert. 
Oh, maybe that's the key. Alright, so we've got to go to Hejara. Is it closest gateway to us? Alright, let's do Hajara. We'll get that key. And then we can get out of here. Still got those octopus things flying around. Go. I'm running away from <coughs> Oh shit. Okay, no, nope. meant to be going up. Might be going the wrong way. Can we get two things on the map? It does. Numbers going down now, so it's good. All right, nice. Numbers are going down. Ah, yes. Here we go. Is it Najara? I think it was Najara. around here so let's confirm that oh is that big circle meaning it could be anywhere in that circle because if that's what it's meaning that's gonna suck might just do a search around for 10 minutes if I can't find it pull in the episode there Go. Let's see where this takes us. So I think we've already found one half of the key, but I don't know if that key. Oh shit! I've gone the wrong way. Yeah, I don't know if the key, um, because we've got half, if that opens that big door at the very end. Because I'm really curious to see what's in there. And I don't know how many Berserker battles we need to do as well, I've got to check that out. So initially I thought I was going the wrong way, but I think this is the way. Ah, uh, yeah, it's, yeah, it's... Like, tell me it's anywhere in this vicinity. This is gonna suck. <laughs> we ended up doing that, which was cool. Like, I can't climb any of these. This is where we found the first half, right? Let's check in and see if by any chance it could be now. It's gotta be close by, right? Like they wouldn't put it in the spot that's like really, really far oh. 
There's a raven there. Okay, so it's got to be something up here because we haven't been up here. Where did that raven go? Hey, buddy. What the hell is that? Where are they at? 46 of 48. Yeah, no, we haven't been here before. We would have gotten this as well. Yeah, another sleeping beast. The handiwork of Alvi Stonefoot. Okay. Björg Stommel. Casualties, cause, 43 dwarven, 22 other. Method of imprisonment, not slumber. Prison location, Alfheim. Date of release, not applicable. It's a troll. Rehabil rehabilitation isn't possible. Feel free to use a rousing relic if you're desperate to get your skull caved in. Imprisonment overseen by Alvis, Stonefords, Fontenheim, otherwise known for he who is running out of patience for writing these reports. No one likes writing reports. How do you wake him up? I want to wake him up. Look, there's nothing to, um... It's nothing really this Freya. Okay. Oh. No, it's not a key, but it's a flower. A dawn bloom. It's five and nine. That's in a random spot too. Let me grab this one. Second key. Sure enough. It's been a bit since we've unlocked a mysterious door. Excited, brother? Hmm. I think I know which door it is. <laughs> Classic. Let's do it. Go, <laughs> Freya. Well, at least we didn't look for too long, hey. Probably spent more time getting over here than, than anything else. Alright, let's go. <laughs> what are we going to come up against? Look at it. It's, this is just screams of boss battle. Something is coming, and it's not happening. Gravel belly. Attacks aren't that bad. We've had worse. Nice. Oh. We could get him first go. The old gravel belly. Gravel belly down. Your guess is as good as mine. Imprisoning a drake. Can't decide whether to be impressed or horrified. Either way, it is over now. Oh, so there's nothing else in there. Gravel belly. 
The gravel belly, we found the drake in the deserts of Alfine behind a door. I had been expecting treasure or a new era or a new area of the desert to explore, but was instead met with the beast. The blue markings on its head were like nothing I'd seen before. They could be considered beautiful were the creature not trying to dig its husk into my flesh. Alright, let's get out of here. We're done. We are done in this area. Alright, we'll pick a new land to explore. Get the hell out of here. And we're in the episode there. Guys, thank you for coming along here. Do Camo's place where now we just really the focus is on the berserkers. But if I can claim like if I can do the big things on the maps as well. Oh as well, right? That was a cool little fight towards the end. Alright. Got you there. Guys, if you can, consider like, sharing, subscribing, really will appreciate it. Especially sharing. Because it helps get impressions. Alright, let's see where we can go. The Eyes of Odin. Well, we've got two more there. Vanaheim. It's the Crucible. Helheim. Okay, let's just go in clockwise order. I don't know if we've done everything here. The problem is you've got to travel here first. Right, let's travel here first, let's have a look. Back to the crater. It has work to be done. See, the warriors still haunt the crater. We could put them to rest. I'm with you. Okay, so there's something to do over here. We'll just go anti-clockwise, not clockwise. <laughs> On the door. Quickly check the map and then we'll end the episode there. So guys, thank you very much for joining us. And then we should load in exactly where we come out. This is a far run. Here we go. Thank you. Okay, let's look at the map. Last remnants of Asgard there. Last remnants of Asgard there. We've got a Berserker gravestone, so that's cool. So where is the closest? So let's go here. We can knock over the three. Yeah, nice. All right, we've got to go to Freya's camp. Freya's camp. Nice. Alright, cool guys. Again, thank you very much. I really do appreciate if you do leave comments and likes and stuff like that. Or even ways that I could improve. Let's jump into it. Wait. Celestial Portal, add it to the map, one there. Alright, cool. See you guys, Kratos out, Freya out. See you next time. Bye for now.